Back again with Lost. This is season three episode. Uh, yeah, season three episode three. Yeah. Um, further instructions. Further instructions. So yeah. last episode was the sun episode where we found out that I guess she's been creeping. Um, so, but I was kind of. I remember thinking that uh, I can't believe that she did this, but I'm also thinking that um, I think this just shows that. Son and Jin's marriage is not a perfect one. You know, we we thought that it was all on him, but I think they're showing that it's also a little about her. You know, because again, it takes two people to really be fuck up a marriage. You know, and I kind of felt like for the last two seasons, we got a lot of his side, uh, why it, he it, the marriage was maybe not be working, but now we're getting a little bit of hers. You know, which I kind of thought that was kind of an interesting way to go about. And um, one of our Patreons, Libby, she was saying, you know, because that guy that died, yeah, we don't know. She, Libby was like, well, you know what? Could it be the son? You know, first, we I, don't know that it was a uh, son's father yeah, who it, hired someone else. Yeah. You know, I think that was a very interesting comment that you brought up, Libby, because I thought that we was first thinking that when you told us, I thought, okay, maybe it was the, um, it was the. Uh, the father who hired someone to kill him. Yeah. But we did see the pearls, okay? Yeah. Um, it was in her hands, and when she went back down to the, the that lady that she ended up killing, and that, it shows that she is capable of killing. You know, that scene shows that she's capable of killing. So even though it didn't show us, I think it's left our minds that maybe she did, maybe she didn't. Because how would the father get the pearls, you know? Would the father like sneak into her house and just steal the pearls, you know? Or um, well, he could have gone. Well, from him or, yeah. you're thinking that he did it, but if the father did it, he's not gonna do it himself. Yeah. No, he's gonna hire someone yeah, else. Someone hired, yeah, exactly. One of those other goons, yeah. and they yeah. would do it. Yeah. Um, personally, I don't think she did it, but um, I, I could see how it could be her. Yeah. I don't think she would do that. See, that's the thing. I do think it's left to interpretation. Some people yeah. could look at yeah. it as her. I personally, um, after that conversation that we had like a couple nights ago, I can go either way. I mean, she did kill someone. And I think in the beginning or some point in the episode when she was telling Saeed, she said, you don't know what I'm capable of. So, I think that's what she said. I think that's what she said. But, um, so, it is showing that... It, it could be could her. Be, yeah, I know? don't think so. But it, I yeah. mean, who? I mean, we don't know. Yeah. Shoot. But um, I thought it was interesting. Uh, what's called? Oh, also, we're on the um, back on the like zoo prison they're in. Um, <laughs> they have like they have Kate smashing rocks for some super reason, and so we're moving him. So what's the point of smacking big rocks with a little rock? This cult is so weird. Yeah, and that's what They have, like, a little community, yeah. and they have a fucking gazebo, Yeah, and they also have, like, bear cages, and an old aquarium. I don't understand what they are doing there. Yeah. Like, I'm, why I'm are they there? For, I'm just waiting for who they pray to. That's what I'm, we're, yes, I'm, I am waiting for them to because say, oh, we prayed. This is weird too. I don't know. Because they showed, they showed Jack that they, the, the other world, or the thing of the, not the other world, the outside world. So those people can leave the island if they want to. You know, they have access to, we, I think it's, they have access to get off the island. Yeah. So mm -hmm. why are they staying here? And I guess it is proof. That what they said last episode. Or they last must be season, like that. Crazy? This is our this is our home. I don't know. Because the guy said this is our home. You guys are just staying here. So I kind of feel like it is kind of their home. If they can leave it and come back. I mean, is it their private island? Like, you live on our private island. Or something well, like if they own the island, then yes, they have every right to yeah. say get off my island. Yeah. But do they own that whole island? I don't know. <laughs> anyway, we're just gonna dive into it, guys. If you scroll the full reaction, you probably should get the picture and the description. And here we go. Okay. Oh, it's that open eye thing, that open eye scene. Yeah, they haven't done that in a while. Oh, is he naked? Yeah, he is. Oh. So you're gone for a whole day after a massive hatch detonation. 
Sorry, am I interrupting something? You need to speak to me. What do you want to... Sand. You need to speak to the sand. Island. Island. He's not gonna it. Charlie. Island. Yes. Island. You need to speak to the island. I like how still no one is really questioning everyone that's leaving. Like, where is our leader Jack? <laughs> <laughs> we haven't seen him in a while. Okay. I need you to stand guard. Oh yeah, so you can talk to the island. Dangerous. What? At the sweat lodge. The something hell is a sweat lodge. When the island was talking to me, you said I was crazy. Maybe you're crazy. That's what I was saying. Oh, this guy. Oh, he looks familiar. This guy, he was the shitty ass Goku in that Dragon Ball Z movie. Um. Nasty day to be hit too, that's for sure. You don't mind my asking, what's in Eureka? Are there a world there? Cotton Timber. Oh, that's is that what, what you do? Uh oh. Uh oh. When you rob a bank. I think it's illegal to pick up a picture. You both please step out of the vehicle. Why? Because the tail light is out? <laughs> now the, the transaction logs and the paperwork for all of them is in the red notebook right there in that duffel. Okay. I can still take you in for picking up a hitchhiker. Yeah, you can't pick oh, up a hitchhiker. That's my uncle. He called me to pick me up. That was weird. Snazzy. It's a sweat lodge. Oh. What's that? You trying to get a high or something? You know. That same stuff you throw on drugs. You throw a bone. I only asked. Is there... Oh. Oh, boom. You brought him back. It's good to see you again. Yeah. Time to sacrifice the island and man. Probably regret staying that. Don't move, you'll speak when you have something worth saying. Mm. I'm gonna help you find your way again. Jump. Then we're back. Oh. Uh, <sighs> Airport's in serious danger. You were the only one who can save it. Thing is this, did you really need Charlie to be the fucking watchdog? Yeah, I feel like you could have done this without Charlie. I think it's how the hell they get out the hatch. He was dragged this way. Oh, someone got him. I won't. By the polar bear. Sion killed the polar bear. He killed a polar bear. Polar bear? Is there another polar bear? You know what? That makes sense now. Why there was a polar bear? 
Because there was a fucking zoo. Oh my god. Yeah, on the, think on the that. island. I completely fucking forgot about that. Yeah. Oh my god. I figured that out. Oh my god. Oh. What's that? That, Eddie, is our sweat lot. Oh, sweat lot. Sweet. What? Anybody who wants can go in there and light a fire and get it nice and hot. Meditate. Look at this. So I suppose why he made one of the island. And then you're supposed to. This is Eddie. He's looking for some logging work, but I convinced him to come home and have supper with us first. Nice to meet you, Eddie. Nice to meet you. Any friend of John's is a friend of ours. Good. John's a very special guy. John brought a guest to supper. So, uh, everyone, this is Eddie. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for the food and the friends. And thanks for the rain today. So that Adam will stop grumbling about the droughts. <laughs> Thank you for helping me stop being so angry. Helping me find a real family. So this is after, after he lost his kidney, right? Yeah, and because they're a hell of a lot better than the one I used to have. So. Where are they? The hats. Oh. Um, it. It's like it imploded. How the hell they survive? How are they gonna? So then they're no longer pressing the button. Then I'm assuming. Yeah. So curly, so curly. Yeah. Oh. Good thing. On that dude behind the hatch. Henry? He was there. He's like the leader. Yep. So, who would be told you to go back to the camp and tell the others? But you're not going to do anything? I am doing something. Go back to the beach, you will. Wait, where are you guys going? The island told Locke he has to save Echo. Shedding? Well, I mean, dogs shed in certain season. Oh, probably den. Yeah, I mean, don't they? I don't know if they hibernate though. I think a black bear hibernates. Yeah, and brown bear too. Brown bear too. Yeah, yeah. I, think, I think they all hibernate, but I don't know about. Polar bears. I don't know about polar bears. What's going on in that greenhouse over there? It's a big secret, John. Sorry. The greenhouse, what do you guys got in there? What do you hide? I've been here for six weeks. Eddie, nothing's I'm not blind, man. Did you forget that you had a duffel bag full of guns when you brought me here? Mike so and Jan welcomed you here with open arms. Oh, they was feed he a you. drug dealer? They give you now I see the fertilizer going into that greenhouse. I know what's going on. What? And I want it. Drugs. You know what? You make drugs with fertilizer? Whatever you guys are trying. I'll talk to Mike and Jan. You're not going in there, Charlie. What? I'm gonna do this alone. Why do you want to go in there? I don't need a reason. Go back. Go back. You got a good reason yeah. to go in there either. You dragged him out here for nothing then? There's a star fire. I know a friend Alex, he blew his goddamn eyebrows off when he did that in Phil's school. I was like, I know that shit works. He's like, ah, <laughs> his eyebrows is gone. Who's that? You alone, brother? Oh. Oh. Uh, yeah. That's mine. Oh, yeah. He's Whoa, naked. Dude. <laughs> I'm not alone. Go off your underwear. Fine. You want to discuss this in great detail right now? No, no, that's okay. I, I got something in here. I don't get that. How can I blow your clothes off but not give you any, like... How do you feel about tie-dye? You know. What's going on? What does it look like? I don't know. You screwed up, John. You blew it big time. Is why, you idiot? John, your friend's a cop. You know how much jail time we oh. get for this much weed? Nice oh, picture, huh? Got him fresh out of the academy. Uh, he was he was hitchhiking. He told me he was going to Eureka. How he was waiting for you, John. He has been here for six weeks gathering evidence because you brought him here. We don't know what he's told. He hasn't even been in here yet. If he's still gathering evidence and trying to make a case, then it's not too late. Not too late for what? To protect us. To protect all of us. It's not too late to fix this. To make it look like it's... Uh, it's I really don't see what the big issue is. It's just fucking weed. Echo. Oh, he's alive. Oh. Oh my gosh. He would be dead. I hope bullshit. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, that's CGI. 
Oh, who's gonna fix him though? Jack's gone. When you say turn the key, you mean like a key key? That's a, a fail safe key. I'm just saying, if you had this magic key the whole time, why didn't you like yeah. use it? I didn't know what would happen. Ooh. You're gonna like turn it into hope or something. <laughs> the whole island vibrated. And Kate and Jack and Sawyer saw two right before they had bags pulled over their heads. Don't worry. Log's gonna go after them. He said so in a speech. What? Oh, I see. He was gonna save Echo and kill bears. Because yeah. I burned that bear pretty good. I don't think he's gonna be coming after us. Now he, that we've survived this. He answered our Two question. Time, we were like, well, why didn't he do that thing you before? Because he, he didn't know well, what was gonna happen. Saw. Yeah. That is he, maybe. I agree with Boone. After all, if you kept pressing that button like Echo told you he to. You wouldn't have had to save him in the first place, yeah. yeah. Charlie, that's what cleaning up your own mess means. <sighs> Spoken like someone who's had a few too many messes to clean. What are you doing? Did you know it would be me? What? In the truck? Did you know it would be me driving? Did, did they choose me? They chose me, Charlie. Why? Because you hadn't been here long, you didn't have a criminal record, and the psych profile said you would be amenable for coercion. Well, for coercion. Easy to manipulate. Yeah. Lower the gun, John. Yeah. Okay? <laughs> it's the most manipulating it's person ever. Person. I'm sorry, John, but you're not going to shoot me. You're not a murderer. You're a good man. Not a farmer. I was a hunter. Sorry. Sorry I ever doubted you. Sorry I gave up on my faith in God. If I just listen to you, if I just let you keep pushing the button, could have done with him. Protected him. Could have saved him. Well, that no, that was out of your control. You can still protect him. Okay. I don't even know where they are. You will find them. After all, you are a hunter. Mm. That's what sent to that guy. Yeah. Is he alive? We need Jack. Well, who the fuck are you? He's not coming back. They got him. What? What are you talking about? Jack's gone? I don't understand. Okay, when were you planning on telling us this, Harley? What do you mean? They've taken Jack. And Kate and Sawyer. How? What happened? Well, what about son and Jane and Sawyer? Silent people asking questions. <laughs> I'm gonna find our friend. I don't know how yet, but I will. He says what he said. But first things first, we gotta look after Mr. Echo. So Paolo and Nikki bring towels and water. This is a speech. Oh, because he, like he said. Yeah. yeah. He, he said that Johnson was saying in a speech. So does he, he have a future? Not a bad speech. Yeah. We don't have deja vu from the future. Oh. It's from the past, right? Sure. Oh. See the future or something now? I don't know, but he still does it. Is some guy gonna give Desmond some chonies? All he has is a shirt on still. What's her dress? Oh wow, that's a fucking weird ass way to do Okay, so we, we got further into Locke, and yeah. I guess after his girl left him, he went to go join a. Yeah, Trying to be fucking Breaking Bad over here. Yeah, it's well, it, it's weed. It's yeah. not what. Breaking Bad does, yeah. yeah. There's that big difference. Yeah, a huge um, yeah. So he joined a group of people that were kind of like family. Yeah. And 
Um, I would say that um, I I didn't really have a problem. Maybe because I'm used to John just being John at this point. But remember when and I think I mentioned this in the, early in the episode, like when Charlie was having his like visions or whatever, the island was down to rescue um, the baby. Um, why was he considered crazy? I mean, yes, he did. He, you know, he's a drug addict, but. Why couldn't someone say, "Hey, are you sure you're okay? Are you in your right mind?" You know, because the island told me this, and now what makes it the island like credible when it's you know? Why makes you credible when the island's telling you that you know, save Echo, which technically is true, you know, like you could have saved Echo, but that's all I had a problem. With. I don't know. It. Like uh, I think Charlie was really placed in this episode. I don't think he was. There was really no need. There was for actually him, no need for him but... at all, actually. And if you guys watch this on YouTube and you shot that kind of out, it's a pretty good chance I'm cutting all this because it's kind of important. He didn't really. Basically, he was standing guard outside the sweat lodge, and then he was standing Certainly. guard outside of the bear cave. Yeah. So okay, yeah. thanks Charlie for doing that. <laughs> um, what else? Uh... Oh, yeah, Desmond. I'm assuming he's like Mrs. Charlie now. He, like he can see the future because like he's getting like. Um, Maybe vision. like flashes, flashes of stuff. But the thing is, I, was it because of that like that machine or whatever the, the thing or whatever the the key button machine thing? Yeah. Like when it expanded, it was a white light. Did it give him fucking like powers of the future? Like that's what Raven. Like if that's the case, then yeah. what about everyone else that was in the blast? Would they have their own powers too? Well, he was closest to it. I mean, but yet again, does that really matter? I mean. But yet, but yet again, fucking Locke was like they were. They were. It all, it all imploded. So if yeah. it happened to him, it should happen to all of them. Yeah. I thought that was kind of weird that the writers decided, okay, you know, let's just put him here. But he was literally close to a fucking explosion. So yeah, let's... put him there and make him naked. Yeah. So <laughs> not just that, but like, oh, well, let's okay. We're we'll gonna have John wake up. Well, let's have John wake up in the middle somewhere. Somehow he escaped it. No, yeah. but I'm but I'm glad though we got John because I, I like that backstory yeah. we got with John. It was good to see him. Yeah. do, you know. I think this scene they're showing different sides of the people like, like last yeah. season with uh, Son. We Your got son. a different side of her. Yeah, like, now we got a different side of yeah. Uh, like she Bob. was a cheater, you know, and in this one we find out he's a drug dealer. So I mean. Oh my god, it's gonna hurt my heart to find out like what. Uh, well, he's not Saeed, a drug dealer. Not More dealer, like a but... drug producer. Yeah. Maker. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's like, um, I don't know. You can make. I don't know. If there's no way to make Sora look even bad. You know. Well then. Well, well they might make him look good. I know they might make him look good. Like, <laughs> Sawyer <laughs> raised the daycare center. You know? Yeah, that would be good. Yeah. Um, but overall, I did find this episode really good, and I really am so a person who is wishy washy with John. But I actually found this episode. It's good to see him a different side yeah, of him. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Really interesting. Like I wasn't bored or irritated with him like I normally am. But I could just be getting dumb to him. At, but it's three seasons now. I could just be dumb to the character at this point. I'm glad Mr. Echo is okay though. Yeah. He's not um, dead because I care about him a lot. I do want to get back to the Jack and Kate stuff. You know. Yeah. Like, well, they had to get back to this because yeah. remember they left for two episodes. So it yeah. Makes so sense. really, we, we need to what happened yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not. I'm not pissed off at it at all. It's completely justify why they did that but um i guess i mean it's a show that could split it you know like maybe go half there half here yeah you know um yeah so anyway fantastic episode guys if you guys want to get the uh full reaction check out the patreon the description and we'll catch you guys next week Bye. Hey, no, no, no.